Good afternoon from the KCAL 9 News Studios. I'm Sandra Mitchell, and you're looking at live pictures right now from Sky 9, where there is a fire burning. This is Woodland Hills, and it looks pretty ferocious because a, a backhoe there, part of a construction crew, has hit a gas line. Conflicting reports from the scene on the number of casualties earlier. I mean, this thing is huge. No specifics on what went wrong, but obviously that gas line was struck and ruptured. Well, that eight-man crew drilling from the electric company, uh, those holes for the power lines when they accidentally hit that main gas. 36-inch pipe with high-pressure natural gas. That's a telling picture right there. And it's pretty amazing, the, the power, the force of that explosion. The solution? Augmented reality in underground construction. So what is augmented reality? Augmented reality is an extension of our senses. The virtual world is not confined to the construction of a room or even any physicality. It's a blending of virtual reality with real life. Augmented reality, as its name suggests, is more concerned with the augmentation of reality rather than its complete replacement. To get a better idea of its nature, let's go through a condensed history of augmented reality's origins. Early theorists like Ivan Sutherland laid a conceptual groundwork for augmented reality. In 1966, Ivan Sutherland developed the Sword of Damocles, which is arguably the first display of augmented reality, allowing the user to project and see a cube in the real world. Sutherland stated in 1965, the screen is a window through which one sees a virtual world. The challenge is to make that world look real, act real, sound real and feel real. In 1990, former Boeing researcher Thomas Codell coined the term augmented reality. We started to see augmented reality used in commercial TVs. For example, in 2013, Volkswagen used augmented reality technology for more practical applications. And in 2014, Google released a pair of glasses that displayed information that overlaid reality and allowed you to control the information in a hands-free format. It's only within the last few years that technology like smartphones and tablets have enabled such development in augmented reality. This technology is completed through the use of engineering, planning, and surveying methods. 3D models were generated through using information and data collected from the site. A variety of techniques were used to capture all of the underground utilities and other underground infrastructure, including geographical information systems, survey, design records, test holes, traditional pipe and cable locators, and ground penetrating radar. Augmented reality creates a platform for workers, materials, and engineers to work integrally and cohesively. Users are able to visualize and gain first-hand experience before the product is even created. Augmented reality can also locate virtual objects in a real-world setting using the correct scale, location, and orientation. Through this technology, owners are able to conceptualize and make changes to the designs early on, which will result in less rework and a smooth construction. The most important aspect of this technology is the fact that it promotes safety of workers through the visualization of underground utilities through augmented reality. With augmented reality, entities are moving toward creating virtual site visits through 3D mockups rather than spending money to create a real mockup design. Hence, saving the company a substantial amount of money while benefiting the environment. Augmented reality can also be a potential benefit to updating the schedule in real time comparing as built and as planned status of projects to give a percentage of completion to the schedule. Augmented reality may also help detect defective work done by subcontractors unknown to the human eyes. By doing so, it allows diverse trades to collaborate better by consistent progress tracking and delivery of schedule. 
The use of augmented reality may also allow for a collision prevention system that would enable excavator operators to continually see underground utilities without inadvertently hitting the utility line. There are so many possibilities for the future and considering augmented reality's current momentum, it will touch every aspect of our lives and become more aligned with Sutherland's vision. That leads us to another question. Is augmented reality necessarily a better reality? Many predict that it will slip into a phase of mixed reality where everything we see in the real world has an added layer of virtual data. Many owners may also feel that the technology itself is rather exorbitant for construction projects that may not fully reap the benefits of utilizing augmented reality in underground construction. Long use of augmented reality may also cause headaches, dizziness, and eye problems. Augmented reality can only work in a prepared environment to have accurate tracking information. It is expected to operate with the highest quality and orientation. However, augmented reality could make mistakes depending on the person creating it. It does not take into account human error. Additionally, over-reliance on AR could pose as a potential threat. If the person who creates the 3D model made a mistake of an inch or two, the over-reliant worker on site doing the excavation might stand a chance at hitting the utility line by accident. In regards to high potential use cases, we have identified that trenchless methodologies have a strong potential to improve by utilizing augmented reality in underground construction. As we all know, directional borrowing is an extremely complicated process, and when things go wrong, many parties will be adversely impacted and large claims and losses are often the result. For example, operators conducting horizontal directional drilling under bodies of water must avoid all sorts of treacherous obstacles such as power lines and gas lines that they cannot see. Shall the operator make a mistake, the damages will be highly catastrophic. Augmented reality is currently used by many industry professionals throughout the globe and has proven itself to be a viable product that could add value to any construction project. Although utilizing augmented reality for underground construction would reap many benefits such as early design adjustments, enhanced collaboration, cost savings, and better material handling, the underlying reason for this video is to promote increased safety during construction through detection of underground materials and prevent inadvertent damages caused by human negligence.